Hey, Tom. Bronson. Oh, hi, Bronson. <laughs> uh, yeah, so can I do the libertarian thing? Sure. No. Oh, okay. Um, so I don't think I should have to pay taxes to the U.S. government. Um, and my reason being that I think the U.S. government is a terrorist organization, and I think it's morally wrong to support terrorists. So that's my basic reason. Well, you actually do have an option. You do not have to pay your taxes, um, but you do have to go to jail. Right, and I mean, that's no different than, you know, telling a woman that, you know, if, if you, you don't have to, you could say, well... Wait, wait you don't have to what? You, what? you, you broke out. up. What you you broke up. Say again? You don't have to what? Well, so, so if you tell a woman, like, you can get an abortion, but oh, then you go to jail, it's the God. same logic. I mean, you, you could use that argument to deny anyone's rights for any reason. Oh, but, but, but it's not your right to not pay taxes. Because you're, uh, you, it's not your right to not pay taxes. I mean, you, could, you have another option. The other option is you could not be a citizen of the United States. Well, right, and that's like telling a woman where abortion is not legal in their state, well, you can just move to another state. I mean, that can be equally used well, for no, any reason to no. deny anyone. In this country, uh, it is um, legal to get an abortion. It is illegal to, get, uh, to not pay your taxes. I mean, you're trying to tell yeah, me but, you're but, trying to tell me that it is immoral to make you pay taxes to a government yeah, that uh, you don't that you don't yeah, to a terrorist organization. Uh, yeah, for the same reason, like if you know, I would well, be I'm telling you, to I'm telling you. But listen, or, okay, hold on, it, Bronson. Honestly, you got to let me respond to you. Okay, I'm telling you that. You can make that case of immoral. It's immoral for you to have to pay taxes to a government you don't support. Well, you do have an option here, and that is you don't have to be a citizen of this government. You can go and be a citizen of a different government that, that, is, that is more aligned with your uh, perspective. I mean— Right, but that equally applies to any other civil liberty that you can think of. Like, oh, if you don't think— that you should go to jail for using drugs, then go to a different country. You know, I mean, that's just, that's kind of a silly argument, and it can be used for a wide... Well, you know, like if, if gay marriage isn't legal in your country, just go to a different country. Well, I mean, you can listen. You can certainly... That argument can be used uh, for a wide variety. You, you, can, you can certainly... I mean, you can certainly um, uh, attempt in the um, uh, political realm uh, to advocate for no taxes. Um, but I can tell you that during the course of the time where uh, uh, marriage equality was not the law of the land, people didn't have the ability to get married in this country. They didn't, and their marriage right. was not recognized. So, in other words... Right, and that's exactly what I'm saying. I don't have the ability not to contribute to a terrorist organization. Yes, I you mean, do. That is oh. my point. You do have the ability to not contribute to a terrorist organization. What if I'm poor? What if, I'm do poor, not what be... if I can't afford to move? What if you can't afford to move? Then you're not paying any t federal yeah, taxes. Well, I said I'd pay sales taxes. Sales taxes go to the state. I don't support any state. I don't. I don't make a difference between a state or a country. I mean, same thing. Oh, to me. All right. Well, okay. I mean, I, 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 what, what is it that you want me to argue here? Well, I mean, I. I, well, I mean, think well, what that is the Walter premise that we're arguing? That that I mean, what is the premise that we're supposed to be arguing here? That we're we're having a debate about whether or not you should be you should have to pay taxes. Well, the you don't I'm pay taxes in, in your scenario. I, I, I'm arguing the libertarian position, um, which is in contrast to Walter Block argued the deontological and cap position. Uh, I'm a consequentialist. Like, I think government is bad objectively. I mean, it, it, by every objective measure or standard that we can eat. So for me, it's not like a, an absolute... You know what? Let's have, a, let's have another policy, debate. Right? Let's have another debate. I think people are bad. I think people are bad, mm -hmm. and I shouldn't be forced to have to be around all these bad people. What's your response? Uh, why, what do you mean by that? What do you mean? What do I mean? I think people are 
bad. They do bad things all the time. I don't think that I should have to be forced to be around them. What's your well, response? I mean, that, why, then, why then would you support putting bad people and giving them extra power that they shouldn't? I mean, why would I don't you think, I think they're all bad. I think all people are bad. This is the question that we're going to debate now. The question is, but, well, why well, do I, I have to be around people? Why shouldn't they all go away? I'm sorry? What's your response to the fact that I don't want to be around people, that they should not be allowed? And I mean, I mean around, I mean like within like a, I don't know, a hundred mile radius of me because they're bad. What is your response? How do you refute that, sir? Oh, I, okay. I think I understand where you're going with this. So uh, that's what living in society is. But I know you're going to go back and say that no. government is the same thing as society, which it definitely is not. Well, but, wait a second. I, wait a second. Why am I forced to live under your rules of society? I want these people gone. Now tell me why that's not, uh, why they're, they're bad people. There are, there are people within, I would probably argue 500 yards of where I'm sitting right now who have, uh, have stolen things, maybe have committed violent acts, um, that have, have done horrible, horrible things. I want them gone. And are you, are you being forced to pay them tribute or what? They're, or I'm like that? sharing, I'm sharing, uh, I'm sharing the space. I don't want them around. Yes. It's tribute. I want them out of my, okay. my well, area. My argument, my, my argument against that would be that it's a difference in scale. I mean, you're not being forced to pay these people scale? tribute, whereas with government you are. Scale? And you're also forced not tribute. Giving what? Excuse me. Excuse me. I, I don't value money in the way that you value money. <laughs> I value my personal space, buddy. So I okay, want to hear so it's a what, scale. Though? Oh, my gosh. It's just a matter of degree. Yeah, sure. So it's, it's okay. So you, so you so in your that, scenario, that should... so in your scenario, so in your scenario, if you pay like ten dollars, it's worse than paying five dollars. Is that it? I'm, I'm sorry. If I pay ten, it's worse than five. Yeah. It's not the principle of paying yeah. taxes. It's the amount. Well, absolutely. I mean, there's no. Oh, such oh thing I as see. So, so, actions. so. I mean, well, I, but then I could simply you turn that right around against you. If you had to pay tribute to that person that you think is bad and I am things, paying tribute would, to them. You would agree I am that, paying tribute. Course. I've you just told you I don't value your society's money from government. I value my personal space, man. And they're no, they, what if they're they're effing it up. House, they're effing it up. I want them out. Well, well, what if they come and kick you out of your house, though? What? What if they come and kick out of your house? You I don't even, never mind out of my house. Concerns. I don't even want them in my general area. Now refute that, please, sir. Why should I be forced to live amongst people like you and the rest of them? Well, that's part of living in society. What? I mean, what? You wanna live, are you yeah, kidding you, you me? You want to live in society? Like, oh, like I could just say, it, like taxes are part of living in a society because we have to, we have to, no, we have to pay for. Oh, no, okay. So you get to say that, but I don't. Do not depend on government. Huh? Do you think that society would magically evaporate in the absence of government? Is that what you believe? Yeah. Do you think people would just stop trading with you, with each other? Would they, I mean, what would what do you imagine would happen if if we didn't have a government? What, what I would I'll like tell you what I would imagine. I'll, I'll tell you what I would imagine would happen. What has happened every time there is a power vacuum, that the strongest would go and become the new government. And we have evolved. We're not in a perfect situation, but we've evolved from where it was just simply the guy with the most swords or the, the most shields. And I do mean guy or uh, had convinced people. Oh, have we? Yeah, have we have. Evolved yeah, that? we have. Yeah. All right. Oh, Bronson, really? Because I'm pretty sure that the police are quite militarized and so is the military. And yeah. they have the most guns and swords right. and things like that. Right, right, right. But so, you know, but you know, at least we've evolved at least to the fiction, if that's what you want to call it, of electing people and uh -huh. having a government pay. Well, right, okay. But you know what, Brian, honestly, you know what? Listen, you should call in. I'm sure there's some fantasy shows. I'm sure there's some fantasy shows like that do like a uh, uh, War of Warcraft or whatever it is. And, and that's what, what you're talking about will make more sense. Because honestly, like oh. the argument that 
the argument that you're saying that you 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 don't want to pay taxes and that there's just going to be a society with no government where all the people, all the good people, nobody's going to have a will to power, right? In your world, there's nobody's now, going they to. They may or may not. It'll be a lower scale than government. Okay. I mean, you, any argument that you good try luck to with that, buddy. The, good the, luck. The good luck. Good luck. If you you basically you, want to go back to some type of time where there's just roving bands of of marauders and it's you think that's a better life and a less no i don't i mean you're you're that's a straw man you're putting words into my mouth that i never said all right that's the best you can come up with it's the best you win ah e deplorabus ductum (laughs) (laughs) all right bronson i appreciate the call all right okay see you sir i just (laughs) i i i hate debates about stuff like you know uh Unicorns are better than a uh, three-headed. This mice. was literally your Stefan Molyneux debate. Hey, so you remember that shit? Like it was completely just a fictional like world. Sam, I would like to debate with you something I call the "Why Should I" principle, <laughs> <laughs> and that's followed in logical progression by the "I don't wanna" theorem. And I'd like to run that by you. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, it's just like. It's like, literally, it's like explaining to Saul, like, he's like, I don't want to sleep. Why do I have to sleep? You can't, you can't make me sleep. Well, that's fine, but you're, you're going to go to sleep because that's what we need to sleep. Why? I, I resent that. It already sounds more cerebral. Yeah, I mean, in some ways. I mean, 